available. Now back to our top story tonight, Winter Haven. Lots of local families headed out tonight to take in all those Christmas lights around town. First alert meteorologist Eric Pickering catching up with folks at Winter Haven, and he takes us there tonight. Down here at Winter Haven, we find people of all shapes and sizes and all ages looking at the lights, and we're joined with Brianna. Hi, Brianna. How are you tonight? Good. You going to see a lot of lights? Yeah. All right, and you're really excited to see a, lights, a lot of lights. How excited are you? So much excited. <laughs> Very excited. Well, we're going to tag along with Brianna. Let's see what we can see. From Santa on the Beach to the Old West, you'd be hard-pressed to find a block in Winter Haven where you can't find jolly old St. Nick. There are so many great sights, you'll want to make sure you pack your camera. And of course, a good pair of shoes. Well, maybe you don't want to walk. That's okay, just hop on a horse-drawn carriage, or maybe a trolley. Or maybe these kids have it right. Take the train. She's fast. <laughs> Thousands of people are expected to pass through to look at these traditional... I took Santa Claus. ...and not-so-traditional displays, but, you know, their beautiful differences make Winter Haven one of a kind. So, what did Brianna think of the lights? Oh, uh, she was cute, wasn't she? And uh, Brianna saw plenty of lights, and there are lots of lights out here live at Winter Haven. Now, the festival goes on from about 5.30 or sundown until about 10 o'clock or around 10 o'clock at night, and that's when all the lights start getting shut down. So tonight, well, it's a little too late, but if you want to come out here, you can come out here through December 27th. We have all the details for you already on KOLD.com slash celebrate. Just go to KOLD.com slash celebrate. There you can take some pictures, and, hey, you can also check out the schedule for Winter you can even drive through Winter Haven. The winds have been gusting today. First Alert Doppler Live has you covered. Right now, still 15-mile-an-hour winds out there, 14-mile-an-hour winds in Green Valley, and 20-mile-an-hour winds hanging on in Douglas. Now, we're not done with the wind, and guess what? We're even going to see the rain make it here before long, but that's not going to stop some people from coming out. Take a look at some of the displays behind me. We'll talk to the uh, people responsible for the display that you're seeing, plus show you a couple more houses. That's all coming up in your full First Alert forecast. Live locally breaking on First Alert Meteorologist Aaron Pickering.